To begin with, search Biomart in Google. Biomart is an open software and the data service developed by an international scientific community. Click on the first result that is Biomart Ensemble. Now click on the Biomart which will redirect to its server. Now you can choose the database which you would like to explore. Here I'll be choosing Ensemble Genes 108. Next we will have to select the data set of which species we want to explore. There are n number of species out of which I'll be choosing the human genes GRCH38.P13 which is the latest data set from Genome Reference Consortium. Once these two parameters are set, it will open up the filter and attributes towards the left side. Select the filter and go to the gene section. Under the input external reference ID list, you can choose several variety of inputs so here I'll be searching based on the HGNC name of the genes. I have pasted the gene list now. Rest all option, key passage. Now click on to the attributes in which we can select the required outputs of the genes. As we need the gene location, we will click on the gene. I would choose gene stable ID, transcription stable ID, gene description, gene start and end, the strand in which these genes reside and gene synonyms. Now let's click on the results. Here we can click on all to see the complete result. Now it will open a new tab with the complete result. Meanwhile it loads the results, let us explore the output options. Here you can explore all results in HTML, CSV, TSV or XLS. The same way the results can be viewed as HTML, CSV or TSV. Click on the result tab. You can see the output such as gene stable ID, transcript stable ID, description of the gene, start of the gene and end of the gene, strand and synonym of the gene. The below mentioned are the complete list of locations based on the genes and their transcripts, whereas the gene start and gene end stays the same. I hope you have solved your query. Do subscribe and click on the bell button to enable the notification for the upcoming videos.